people, 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 people. Welcome back. Vitamin Y. Thursday. Cosmic Key Bell. So, uh, of course, you saw Webcam Duels. God, that Red Eyes Key Bell deck. I, the problem is, I don't know how to make a Red Eyes deck. I think that's the major problem. I don't know how to make a good Red Eyes deck because in my eyes, I don't think Red Eyes decks are that good. You know, and uh, of course, not only do I have to make a Red Eyes a red eyes deck, which I don't think that's actually that good as a standalone deck. But then I also got to throw you Bellas cards in there, and it's just ah, that deck is just very difficult for me, and I really want to get it, but God, is it just difficult? Anyway, Cosmic Evo still on here, and at this rate, it'll probably be on here for a while. Uh, Cosmic Evo has been doing okay. I really can't say I'm blown out the water by it, but you know, I really have no complaints from it right now. Uh, especially putting back Beyond uh, gives me access to more plays because you know when I really sat down and thought about it, I was like, wait, why did I take out Beyond? Like Beyond is, uh, you know, Beyond is at least close to what I want when it comes to that. Because I'm sitting here like, man, I don't got no fucking beaters. All I got is Suwani, but you're not running Beyond. At least he's 16. Like man, Mass Chameleon, all he does is summon back Suwani, and all I can go is the Xyz or it's rank four plays. Man, I wish I could fucking Black Rose it up like I do in other decks. Beyond. <laughs> you know, like, Beyond helps, Beyond helps, Beyond helps, so there is, I have no complaints with the return of Beyond. Hey, even Beyond even gives me access to uh, Chao Feng, who I actually put back. Uh, I took out Laval Train because uh, I don't make Laval Train in here. You know, if I can, if I can go into, I was thinking, I'm sitting there thinking about it, like, if I can go into a rank 4 XC monster, it's not going to be Laval Train, not in this deck, not in this deck, you know. The, the Yangtze monsters can summon out each other, and you're the only person I really want to send to the graveyard like that is Yubel. So, I was like, nah, I don't need a wild chain. If I'm going to XC, you know, I might go into King of Thrones to keep my Mass Chameleons up. Not in this hand, because I got, you know, I got Mass Chameleons for days, I know, two of them. But, um, you know, Castell, yeah, and next time, you know, those two. Castell next time, definitely. Alright, my phone's going to start and quit. Alright, um, of course, our Medusas are five, Goyos are six. Uh, I still like Clear Wing as our seven, but of course we have our uh, Yazzie and then Kiss and the Black Row. So, see, I get access to Clear Wing, I get access to Yazzie, I get access to cards like this just because of Beyond. So, there we go. Not bad. So, you know, if I'm going to run cards like these, I should run Beyond. And, of course, Cha Feng, what I can have do with him. I think I need him, Suwani, and Jiao Tu. Is that right? Is that math right? Yeah, that's nine. So, there we go. And then my opponent can't act, period, cannot activate the effects of Earth, Fire, and Dark powerful you know i'd probably put him into like defense mode or something i probably wouldn't even touch him or allow him to do anything because even when there's no uh bixie of course i'd still be affected by trap cards leo's are 10 uh starters are 11 and then i mostly go into eight so i'd like you know one of the best level eight synchros hot red i can go into beals and then two Baxios. that's that's a fine extra deck to me all right, so my opponent just squapped it up and didn't even figure out what i was doing again so I, you played upstart and you must have it's just that a shitty hand. I apologize, sir. So we're going to go ahead and get another duel in. Like I said, beyond, I was trying to run other things. So I was like, oh, let's try Supply Squad. Oh, man, I hate Supply Squad. Man, I don't know what to fucking play. Beyond. Beyond. <laughs> oh, Drew your bell. Well, that's stuck in my hand. That's the problem with this deck is that I don't run cards like Dark Reffer because there's not a lot of darks that I want to pitch. Literally, I try to number generate. So literally, this, duel, this deck is not really a... Uh, a uh, Yubel deck at all. It's mostly a Yang Zing deck with Yubel put in it. Like, I have one of each Yubel, one Armageddon Knight to number generize, one Rota to number generize, one Fu- you know, I'm trying to get it and just like I can number gen- I can try to attempt to number generize um, the Armageddon Knights, that Armageddon Knight that Rota and that Foolish, I can easily just get the one Yubel. So, you know, unless I straight up have so many cards in my hand that, you know, I have to pitch, Yubel's pretty much stuck in my hand. All right. This card and card, then it might be better just to go ahead and mill it so you can tell it, so you can reveal it to flow resolve the card. Well, well, resolve, 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 res stop, 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 resolve vendor first, resolve vendor first. Yeah, resolve the vendor first. <laughs> Draw, reveal it to me. Okay. Alright, alright, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, guys, go ahead. No, go ahead. <laughs> you guys are gonna start saying that now. Go ahead! <laughs> it sounds like some sexual act, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright. 
I'm not sure who I want to summon because I'm not really going to overextend. Literally, I might just go Math Command and summon back B. I make a Black Rose. So, uh, I'm just going to go ahead, and it has to be in defense position. So, I'm going to go ahead and summon Baxia? Yeah, Baxia. Baxia. So, just like in good old uh, Fluffle Fright for fashion, without Polly, they don't do much. Yeah, that's a lot of that. That's that's the problem with fusion, fusioning, Fus fusioning, fusing, fusing. So why is it fusioning? Fusing. That's what's wrong with fusion. Is that you have to have a Polly, which is in your deck, you know? It's not like, oh, I got two of the same level, bam, XC. Oh, I got a tuner and a non-tuner. It's, you, of course, you can run a lot more tuners and you can polys, and then bam, you know? Polly, on the other hand, you know, I, I, say, I always feel like out of all of them, out of all the extra decks ones, out of uh, Fusion, out of Synchro, out of XC, and now Pendulum, because you gotta kind of include them too, because they're kind of an extra deck. Uh, I'd say Fusion's the weakest, but not gonna judge. All right, so we're gonna summon Maximilian. Effect. So the thing with the, with this now is that if he negates my effect with like a like a breakthrough skill or a Phoenix Chain, I can just go ahead and go into a Goyo Guardian. So, so I will not get I will not get Bixie effect. That is right. I will not get Bixie effect because I can only special summon from the extra deck if I go into Black Rose, which I'm gonna go into Black Rose. So let's see if you have an effect, your response to this with this card. This, oh, you get a search too. I forgot. This card is sent to graveyard. So is that effect optional or mandatory? Uh, this card is sent to your graveyard. You can't add an edge, so uh, that's up to you. I'll leave it to you. What's this do? When a power monster you control is destroyed by your opponent's uh, 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 token, one one of those destroyed monsters and add to your hand if you do draw a card. Ooh. That's a plus. You play it, you add back your monster and you draw. Mm, that's good. I did not get Bixie, Baxia, Bixie effect. Let's say Baxia, Bixie effect. Go ahead. Like I said, your effect was optional. If it was mandatory, I would have told you about it, but it was optional, so I'm not going to say anything. It's not my job. It's not, it's not my job. And now we start fucking you up with the big beater. So one E. And then we'll go ahead and set that in reverse. I, I, don't, I don't know. Like I said, I, I, I didn't like Baxia. I mean, I didn't like Beyond. No, Beyond's putting it at work. <laughs> Beyond is putting it at work right now. Ooh, Owl. All right. So, at least Owl helps because you get a poly. Yep, yep, yep. And Tiger is coming out in America. So, sorry, Lunar. Because <laughs> I know Lunar likes Fluffles and, you know, we don't have Tiger now. We're getting Tiger, but I think it's like a V-Jump or something. It's like, it's like... It's like whatever the, the, the exclusive that you only get in America, in North America, so, sorry. <laughs> but at least Fluffles will hopefully be a playable deck here in the TCG, because you, you can't play, you can't play without fucking uh, Tiger. You can't. Like, you need Tiger. Tiger is the fucking man, and if you're not playing Tiger, then you're not living. Like, like Fluffles without Tiger is like fucking, is like Cleese without Scout. <laughs> that's a nice, that's a nice analogy. Like... They're still a deck, but are they threatening? Not at all. You know, if, Cle if Scout got banned, man, nigga, Cleese, ooh, you know, you would lose a nice shot. Like, you wouldn't play Summoner's Art anymore. You, you, you'd have one Sacrifice, you know. They might even put out, you know, you could probably even put Sacrifice up to three if you're going to ban Scout. Like, damn, that hurts. <laughs> you know, as I said, so come with, I think they're probably going to put Scout down to one, but I think that's as far as they're going to take it. I don't think they're going to ban Scout. Scout's not ban worthy. Although that's what we were talking about with the same thing with Stratus and look at that nigga. Ha <laughs> What the fuck was that? Yeah. What's this do? Target one full full of five for much great break pressure summon it, but the effects are negated. You can't really one out of Alright, that's fine. Suture rebirth. And then you're just gonna return. Alright. Uh go ahead and flip summon. Normal summon. And synchro soaken into six. Goyo Guardian. Uh, 
attack. Yep. Give me that. So Glory Guardian is 3300 right now. Nice and powerful. See? He's not fusing! Fuse! <laughs> I said, Shuffle don't fuse. They don't do anything. Like, it, like their they're monsters are all about their fusions. Therefore, you know, they don't do anything. You know what, sure. Yeah, he's like, that was a bad hand left, but that black guy didn't help. Alright, I have to tear it out. Alright, it's gonna go ahead and play it again. So, you have to open up the same play. Alright, it's gonna go ahead and pitch bear and reveal that to me. Nope, defusion, defusion. Okay. That seems like a side card for you. <laughs> See, I've got some kind of graveyard effect. This card is sent from your hand. Uh, this card is sent from your hand to bear. You can set one toy vendor. Do you want bear effect? I guess not. Okay. So, do you want burr? Burr. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and attempt to Gia. G -g 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 Gia! <laughs> I'm probably not the first one to ever do that. Okay. Beyond! Coming through! Coming through, Gia. Send to you. Okay, it just says send to. So. Doesn't specify. If it has to be like one with like zero attack and zero defense, well, I summon has to be zero attack and zero defense. So, of course, we're going to go ahead and summon you and you. Then we'll go ahead and fuse. Oh, oh, I about to say fusion shotgun. Hello, synchro shotgun. <laughs> Axia. Effect. Return your field. All three. And then you pretty much lose again. It's fucking powerful. I'm also unaffected by trap cards, so. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Sua effect. That's is 2100. So. Book. See? It even helps Gia with its effect. I rarely get that off too, so. That's nice. That's nice. Anything past, I'm not gonna use it right now. Like if he, oh wait, whoa. Oh, I have, I had a pitch to and then summoned it. Yeah, I was like, wait, I have way more Yang Sings than I was anticipating. I'm not gonna use it right now though. I might use it in a sec. Actually, you know, I should have used it. What do you do? Using Badge on Poly, blah, 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 blah. Nothing, <laughs> nothing right now. All right, I'm actually gonna activate you because I might get what I want. So I wanna keep you. I want you back, you back, who do I want back? Hmm, I want you back. I'm running two paths, because sometimes I run a lot of rivals, so I'd rather revive it from the graveyard and return it to the deck, but then also, uh, ooh, uh, I don't want it to be cloggy at three, so I think two is fine. All right, all right, all right, all right. I think I can end this duel. I can summon Beyond, use Baxia Effect, destroy you, and summon one of you, and then Beyond Effect will summon one for my deck, then I can activate Limit Reverse and summon... Or my, oh yeah, yeah, that's game. That's game. Yep, that is game. So summon Beyond, Baxia Effect, target Beyond, and Bixie. So, destroy Beyond, summon Bixie, Beyond Effect. I will go ahead and summon Sua, activate Limit Reverse, summon back Jia, Jia, Synchro Shulkan again, and two, heals, last game, 28, 35. The power. <laughs> the power. Like, seriously, like, does it look like... Oh, wow, you want another one? Let's go again! Alright, this will seriously be the last one. Because... And, and you're like, wait, you're thinking about taking this deck off of Vitamin Y? But you could say, when did I use Yubel at all? I'm just doing Yang Zing plays. I don't use Yubel at all. 
Oh, all right. So Rhoda for my one fucking Armageddon night. But the Armageddon night's supposed to send you bell when I drew the U bell. And I don't have any rival cards anyway. So. And then pitch scissors, draw. Hopefully you got one. Because if you don't. Yep, you got one. All right. Sheep. You better fucking pray to God that I don't draw Gia. Gia. All right. <laughs> I was gonna say you better fucking pray to whatever God you believe in. So yeah, Armageddon Knight can get me. I mean, Rudder can get me Armageddon Knight, but then who the fuck will Armageddon Knight send? You know? Yes, Gia. Good. <sighs> Do you have like any effect or something? No. All right. Go ahead and send Swanee. And I'm gonna have someone kill your sheep before sheep gets too powerful. I wonder if he has his trap card again. Yep, he does. So, the power. I was like, I wonder if he has that trap card again. I have my trap card too. God. Why are you showing me your hand? Don't show me your hand. Nigga. Don't show me your hand. I'm going to pretend I didn't even see that. I'm going to pretend I didn't even see that. I'm going to pretend I didn't even see that because that, that makes me sad. Don't, don't. Knowledge is power in Yu-Gi-Oh. Power! And you showing me that. Don't do that. Makes me feel guilty now because I shouldn't have saw that. It's like, it's, like, it's like peeping on a fucking lady while she's taking a shower. Not that I have any experience with this. Like, let's have another time. I don't, okay, I don't. But I'm just saying, that's kind of how I feel. It's like I got, I have to see something I should, I shouldn't have saw. It's like peeping, you know. It's kind of like Minecraft. It's like you have to peep into there while they're taking a shower. Dirty, dirty girl. Sure, I got like a revival card. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and send Gia because I feel like I can get access to. Oh wait, in your extra. Like, nigga, it's your deck! <laughs> like, what, what do you mean? Why is there no Fluffle Tiger or Wolf? Like, I don't know what you mean by that. I'm sorry, I'm thinking about sending... Sending, uh, Jail too, because if I get a Revival card, I can, I can combo off better. I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm getting a night attack. Like what he's talking about is going shoot right over my head. Like are you talking about like the name change or something? I, I need to show you. I need to show you. Your your defense is eighteen hundred. I'll deal with you in a sec. I could Castell you, shit. Alright. Alright, you're dead. I could Castell you. And I said I feel guilty because I saw his hand. I, I, I saw something. I don't feel like Castelling you. <laughs> nah, I'm okay. Go ahead. I could, but... Nah. I'm surprised this man's not getting tired of me whooping his ass over and over again. Listen, I'm not going as ham this duel. I don't like Vendor. Maybe it's just me, but I don't like that card. It's because you fucking neg. Look, look at this. You are negging like crazy. Ooh, you could add one card. Shit, you could add uh, the, the, the Poly S card. Oh, I thought he's going to go ahead and crash into me. He can add that fucking, uh... Maybe I should have cast out you, because he can add his, uh... Miracle fusion as card. Whew! So... Maybe that's what he's gonna do. Yep. Yeah. 
Alright, you're in main phase two. Well, you're gonna go to main phase two, so I don't have to worry about you fusing. And attacking me at least. Fright for fusion! Oh, sheep. Oh, no. That's, that's tiger. That's tiger. There's no wolf. It's not gonna be wolf. That's tiger. One, two, three. Do you select your targets? I don't know how I so you could target the bridges too. Show them all. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn. One, two, three. Sua effect and uh creation. Mm, I, there's one particular play that I really want to do, just to do it, especially since my opponent's not really burning me back row. I want to do this play, guys. I'm going to end this video by doing this play, alright? So, Creation, you're going to go ahead and summon a Sawani, and and Sawani, you're going to go ahead and summon a GL2. Like, guys, get ready. You're, we're about to do a play, and it's pretty much going to lock him out as a tool. <laughs> like... It's gonna be it's gonna be cute, but I, I I wanted to try this. I've always wanted to try this, and we're gonna pull this off. Especially since I'm not really seeing any bit much background from him. Uh, hello. Uh, I'm recording right now. All right, bye. Yes, my ringtone is boogie on and on, which is my intro and my outro. That's my theme song, guys. Like, yeah. <laughs> That's my theme song. <laughs> Alright, so next turn we're gonna do it guys. We're gonna do it. You're gonna be like, oh damn. Summon. Sink nine. Oh my god, here he comes. Here he comes. Blah. Chow Fei. <laughs> the power. Ah Chow Fei. <laughs> So, uh, Sua effect Chow is 3,300. Damn. Alright. So, it's assume summon. Your opponent can activate the same attribute, so he cannot, once again, he can't do earth, dark, or fire. So powerful. Now, on this card, the secret summon martial control by battle card effect and summon Once per turn, when an opponent's martial is destroyed by battle, you can spread his. By battle of card, when your opponent's monster, your opponent controls the strong, you can special summon one one time monster in defense position whose original attribute matches the original attribute of one of the shit monsters from you. Alright. Alright, it's fine. Damn, no! <laughs> you just saw fucking. You just saw Chow Feng, you're like, oh hell no! <laughs> like dark, 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 everything is dark, everything is dark, the fusions are dark, 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 so they literally can't activate anything! Like, whoo, Chow Feng! Yay, Chow Feng, I finally got to summon it. Like I said, I could've went for it. I could've went for a Baxia and then spot everything back, but I really wanted to go into Chow Feng. So, I'm kidding. of course, I would've killed one of his monsters, and then his monsters are dark, so I had to go ahead and summon a dark from my deck, so... Uh, I wow, well, oh, whoa! I don't, I don't have any, I don't have any more Gs. I must have. No, there's one, two. I, I must have missed it. There it is. Yep, seven Gs. I am. The power. It's all good. <laughs> it's not bad though. So I said, and this is the funny. I'm actually planning on taking this deck off, but like I said, it's not really Ubel. Like, did you see any Ubel plays today? No. No. You saw me draw you belt, but did I play you belt? No, absolutely not. Uh, I've really I feel like Red Eyes might have a little bit more synergy. But I don't know. It's hard to get rid of, it's hard to get you belt right because not only do you get to send you belt, but then you gotta destroy you belt and it's just really difficult to get correct. You know, I'm running cards like Dark Hole and the Fair Charge and the Fairness, but then I gotta get you belt to the graveyard and it's just <sighs> Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call it for an episode of Iron Wise. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with Supervisor Bell. All right, people. Thanks for watching.